Well, another task associated with keeping a tidy house is beating the futon. However, on my balcony there really isn't enough room. I can't get enough torque. So I take this thing over to the park. So let's walk over to the park with the futon to beat it. Now, I don't have a regular futon beater, so I use a coat hanger. And this thing works pretty good. So we just walk over to the park here. With our futon. I think we're going to be alright with the weather today. I don't think it's going to rain. Ideally, you'd want to beat your futon when it's a nice sunny day, but... Since I haven't beat my futon for a while, I think I should do it today regardless. And what I do is I walk it over here to the monkey bars where I string it up over the top one here and I get ready to beat it. But one of the first things we got to do, there we go, one of the first things we have to do, and this might seem a little bit odd, is we have to bait the cats. Uh, there's lots of wild feral cats in my neighborhood, and I don't know what they're going to do to my futon when I'm not looking. So what I do is I take a couple dishes and I use Calcan. Calcan. It's a name I trust from my childhood. Now I never ate Calcan, but but uh, we did have cats, and so I, I trust this name, and I think the cats are going to like it. So what we want to do is put a little. A little cow can in a couple dishes. Oh yeah. Put a put some cow can in a couple dishes, and then we set them over here, far away, because these cats they could pee on my futon. I don't really know what they're gonna do. Actually, I'm gonna set them over here. Cats usually come from an, uh, from an easterly direction. So there we go. We set one here. We'll set one over here. And that way, they will leave my futon alone. Then we get back. Now, actually, I have another, another package of Calcan just in case uh, I need more. But that'll keep the cats away. And then we go to beat the futon. It's quite simple, really. You've got to, you've also got to flip it too. And you let the sun shine on it to get rid of the dust mites. Yeah, this coat hanger, it's got some heft to it. Works just as good as a futon beater. We get that side. And then we get this side. Now I'll repeat this process a couple times. And I will also do this with my uh, blanket while I wash my sheets. So anyway, that's, that's what beating the futon is all about. Let's see if we've attracted any cats. I see no cats yet. Uh, I will get back to you and tell you uh, how the beating of the futon went. It's a nice little park, isn't it? 